three, two, one, rolling. I just had to say something else. See, um, there's a term that says they say hedge your bets. So hedging your bets is like you're betting on, bet you're placing your bets in such a way that if you win, you don't really lose, and if you lose, you know you still win. So that's what hedging your bets, at least as far as I know, is what it means. And building a website, it gives you, it's actually a way to hedge your bets. Because when you build your website as by yourself, you have to do it by yourself so that you learn how to do it. And once you learn it like anything else, like when you were learning to do cakes, you will get good at it and you will get better at it. Once you build your website, you'll be able to raise your prices, you'll be able to raise your profile, you'll be able to make more money and you'll be able to actually get better at your business. So building your website will help your cake business on its own by itself. But then when I call it hedging your bets is because if for any reason you decide I'm tired of cake decorating and I want to do something else or I'm tired of these cake customers and you know who we're talking about those customers and I want to do something else. I want to start a blog. I want to make money online. I want to teach online. I want to do, you know, like what I'm doing here, record some classes and put them online and get people to buy. Or I want to do something else with my, I want to start blogging about crafting or, or water rafting or whatever. Then you know, you already have that skill. So please join this class and learn how to build a website. It's not that difficult and if you're determined and not afraid, just come and join us.